Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome to Let's Play Games That Make Me Want to Go Insane and Throw Things Against the Wall. I mean, Let's Play Adventures of Lolo 2. So, uh, I gave you a quick glimpse of this level at the very end of the last video, but... Really, it's not that intimidating. It looks more intimidating than it actually is. Uh, first things first, you gotta block this Medusa from that side. Then grab this, and we have our power, p hammer power up. And, uh, we can grab this. And then we don't even use the hammer power up yet. We use it to the very end of the level. But all we do is just use our last shot to push the snake up. And then we just grab all of these hearts. There's really no catch. There aren't going to be any traps or anything. You just go around and grab all these hearts. That's all you do. And the last thing you do is just hit this hammer. Or hit this rock with the hammer. And you get these last two hearts. And now you can just safely get the treasure chest. Just be very careful though. Because as you can see, a goal will be firing at us. But, you have enough time to actually get to the chest and uh, make it disappear before it can actually hit you. And there we go, level completed. Oh, uh, great, another one of these levels. Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and just start grabbing things. We have two shots already. Probably gonna make use of them, I'm pretty sure. Now, what we want to do here is we actually want to use that goal on the side of the Medusa because if we use it at the very top it'll get us when we're going for the treasure chest we do not want to use it like that I assure you we do not want to use it like that so what I'm gonna do here hmm I'm trying to think though cuz I can actually do this in a few ways but Actually, let me go ahead and get this one, because there's no other way to get this one. And we have more shots, which is a good thing. Let's see. Oh, I got it. I can't get to the goal, though. That's the thing. I can't get to the goal without... Actually, I think I can. I'm just not thinking hard enough. Huh. This is actually a lot harder than I thought it was. Actually, we might be able to use Rocky, maybe. Because if I remember correctly... Like, like, let me do some things before I actually try this, because... We know Rocky... Uh... Actually, there we go. Now, if we do this right, we can actually push him here, grab this... And look, we don't actually have to use them anymore. Now we can actually go around. But, there is another problem that arises from this. Because now I don't have any shots. Oh, wait. I forgot about this other heart that I need. Oh, no, still don't have any shots. Hmm. Okay. Maybe that's not how we solve it. Okay guys, I'm back. I took a little pause break off screen just so I could look at this level more carefully and see if there's like another way I could maybe do this. But to be honest, like, the way you do this puzzle, it's just like, there are many ways you can go about doing this and they all involve pretty much using Rocky to some extent. So there's not really much I have to really say about this puzzle. So, let's see. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just do what I have been doing, or what I've been, like, brainstorming in my mind. It might not work, but it's better than doing nothing, probably. First thing you wanna do is you wanna get Rocky out of here, because Rocky needs to be out in order for this to work. And when he comes back down, you can go up here, and then you can do what I was, uh, thinking about, or talking about, on camera earlier. Well, first I'll see if I can grab this heart. Um, okay, that works. And now we try to get... Oh, shoot. Okay, that works. That's actually fine. Now, the last thing we want to do is we want to try to get Rocky over here, somehow. Because we have one last part to do before we finish this. Because the Medusa is uh, completely open on the right side. So let's see if I can actually do this. It's kind of tricky though, because you have to lure Rocky out of here, and it's not really that easy. 
because this pathway isn't very... I don't know, it's just not... Okay, there we go, that works. Now let me see... Oh, shoot. Okay, that didn't actually work, but... It's not over yet. It's still... I can still finish this. It's just going to require a little bit of luck. Okay, shoot. Okay, now I have to make sure he gets back out. Ah, come on. There we go! Yes, finally. Okay, next level. Oh, jeez, I hate these kind of levels where you have to depend on snakies, but that's pretty obvious right there. I think I actually figured out how to solve this already, actually. Well, what you want to do is you don't want to grab this heart just yet, because... We're actually going to be using this goal as a boat, I guess, or an egg float or something. We're going to basically ride it around the water. We have to wait for this one to sink, though. And keep in mind that it sinks right there. That will be very important. Okay, so turn you into an egg, grab this, push you in here. Now we're going to be riding this thing around until we get above the box. And then all we do is just push this down, and then we turn this into an egg, and then we finish the level. And we're up to floor six, I think. Alright, floor six. Okay. Oh geez, Don Medusa, of course. It wouldn't be Lolo without a little bit of Don Medusa. Ah, not quite. Actually, oh, that was kind of stupid. I actually thought of something I could have done. Oh, shoot. That was close. Anyways, let's wait. Now let's grab it. Now let's grab this. There we go. We can push you over here. Block you from there. Now, I think there's a trick here. Because normally, you would think that, well, if I just push it one half square over, it'll block both of them. Then we just use the snake and get the heart up here. However, the problem is those skulls, because if we do that, then the skulls are going to come right at us, and we really don't want that, so... We have to do this a different way. Still kind of the same way, but just a little different. So we do, what we do is we go all the way over here, grab this, and we wait for the skulls to come get us, but, oh, that was kind of wrong, actually. Yeah, I have to redo this. Bad. There we go. Then we just ride this over here and get to the box before the skull gets loose, and there we go. I really don't know how well I'm doing for time here. Uh, let's see, this one... Well, it looks like we're going to be using those snakies again. Let's see. Okay, four shots. Not bad. Let's move you right here. Okay, yeah, this is not that hard at all, actually. Quickly grab this. And... Fire! Then we grab this. And then all we do now is just block the Medusa from the other side. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's go on. Oh, this one doesn't look too bad either. Let's see. Yeah, because we're given boxes, we can actually block the majority of these skulls out. So, let's see. Right away, let's just put you here. Probably not going to be the correct thing to do, but... Again, trial by error. That's pretty much the main focal point of this game. Huh. Okay, never mind. Once again, I'm overthinking. Okay, yeah, we used... I know. Let me get this one first. Ah, oh, shoot. I shouldn't have done that just yet. Because now I have more work. 
Yeah, I probably screwed this up already, but it's... I don't know, let's see. If I do this right, I might be able to do it correctly, but... I doubt it. Yeah, I think I grabbed that too early. Yeah, I think I'm finished. And... Let's just block you again. Go back down here. And block you from here. Now you're probably thinking that, well, how are you supposed to finish? Because the skulls will get you once you grab that heart. Well, no they won't. There we go. And I'm going to end here because I don't know how much time I have left. I probably used up all my time anyways. So this is Slim Kirby. See you guys next time for more. Let's play the Adventures of Lolo 2. See you guys next time.